Okay, so now it's time to start the seasoning process on our bales. Um, it, it's, a, it's fairly straightforward. It's gonna take about two weeks, maybe two and a half weeks, depends on weather conditions and, and whatnot. And again, it's, it's not an exact science, guys, so don't worry about it, okay? So we got our weed guard down underneath the bales. That's gonna prevent the grass from growing up. We've got the cut side of our bales facing up. And that's going to help the fertilizers, fertilizer penetrate the bales. Uh, for the first couple of days, when you first get your bales set up, you're going to want to soak them down really well with water. So you're going to you're going to hose them down to the point to where you see water running out of the bottom of the bales. And uh, I, now, for me, I've had these bales out here for a month, uh, but the weather just hasn't cooperated. We've had Plenty of rain, plenty of cold, and last week we haven't even had a few inches of snow. Oh, come on. This is some bull. So I know these bills are wet. They're soaked through and through. Uh, so I am not really going to worry about watering them. I can just go straight to the seasoning process. Uh, if you've got dry bills and you just get them set up, water them for a couple of days before you do this process. All right, so what we're gonna do is, we're gonna take our high nitrogen fertilizer and we're gonna add a half a cup to each bale. And we're just gonna sprinkle them on. Just as evenly as possible. And it's not a big deal. I mean, just get it on there, okay? It's gonna work its magic. Yeah, okay, so this is day one. We're gonna add a half a cup of high nitrogen fertilizer per bale. Half a cup. Just sprinkle that nice and even. All right, perfect. So you get the idea. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take care of the rest of these bales and we'll be in good shape. All right, be back in a bit. Okay, now we have the uh, half a cup of fertilizer applied to each bale. Now it's time to water that fertilizer in. And let me tell you a mistake I made uh, over the last couple of years is you, you see this fertilizer uh, laying on top of the bales. And what you try to do or, you know, your thought is, okay, I got to get this stuff into the bales. And you just spray it and spray it and spray it to try to dilute that fertilizer and get it all to soak into the bales. Well, what I kind of figured out over time was that's really a waste of time and it's a waste of water. Uh, the microbes that are going to feed on this nitrogen, they're going to come for it. They're, they're going to come and get it. So what we're going to do is we're going to put approximately one gallon of water per bale. And that's going to be just enough to help soak a little bit of that nitrogen down into the bale and it's going to draw those microbes up to feed uh, so let's get started 
Now I'm just gonna use somewhat of a jet spray, nothing crazy. And it will kind of help push a little bit of that fertilizer down into the straw. But again, it's, it, it's, not, it's not an exact science. It's not a big deal. And I'm going to just add what I think is about a gallon of water per bale. I don't know, what do you think? Is that a gallon? I don't know, it's gotta be close. Good enough. All right, let me finish up the rest of these bales and uh, we'll be good to go. That will be day one of the seasoning conditioning process for our straw bale garden. All right, guys. Okay, friends, so I've got the half a cup of high nitrogen fertilizer on each bale. I watered that in with approximately one gallon uh, of water per bale. And that's it. We're going to let it sit uh, until tomorrow, uh, which will be day two. Now on day two, we will not apply fertilizer. We're just going to water one gallon per bale. So that does it for uh, straw bale gardening, seasoning day one uh, one thing you might have noticed was these second year bales uh, i am not seasoning these bales and the reason is is they're already broken down from last year and really i don't want them to break down that much more uh, what i will do is add a uh, a a balanced fertilizer when I'm ready to plant. So a 10, 10, 10, 12, 12, 12, something like that. And I'll add that balanced fertilizer at the same time that I add the fertilizers for the new bales. Okay, folks, until tomorrow, have a great day. This is uh, Bruce City Gardener and I'm out.